and hardest boss fights. Now, most now most of you have these experienced boss fights, right? When you play them, you say, oh yes, this is the one. But what if I told you that there were some incredibly difficult fights? Hi, this is Cam Animation's Genty, and I'm counting the top five hardest boss fights of all time. Because I haven't done any of the fights, like the uh, Alma fight or the fight with Mike Tyson and Punch Out, they won't be included. Number five, Sands from Undertale. I put this boss at number five because there could be much harder bosses on it that I fought than this. Basically, this fight, this fight has you, uh, well, when you get to the final boss in the genocide route, you have to, Sand starts the fight with his strongest moves, and, well, that's not what enemies usually do when you encounter them. So you have to be, so you have to memorize his moves very quickly, and most players end up dying, dying the first time they see this. Any determined player ha can stand a chance against this fight. Excuse me, I gotta go to the bathroom. And yeah, the fight will definitely have you doing this. Number four. Uh, Dark Bowser from Mario and Luigi Bowser's Inside Story. If you thought punching Dark Bowser and absorbing the Soul of Foth was bad enough. Uh, just wait till you have to play as Mario and Luigi. It'll take you forever. Bring lots of healing items, level up a lot, and make sure that you have all your stuff upgraded. Yeah, all that. The fight with the uh, the fight with Genshin and Ninja Gaiden 2 was insanely difficult. And thus the sun sets on the dragon ninja bloodline. He has attacks that are really hard to avoid and hard to block. Until I found out that the main strategy for me was keep blocking, keep attacking until he was dead. Yep. Number two. The final boss from Mario and Luigi Dream Team. Finally, when you get to the final boss in Mario and Luigi Dream Team, Dream Bowser, you have to constantly. He constantly keeps attacking and healing. He summons enemies, heals, and even has attacks that are hard to dodge. Like his hammer move, which is really hard to hammer back. Plus, he'll do it twice. And, and well, the, by far the easiest attack to avoid has to be the, well, the, the fireball move, where he summons two clones to fire. This is what the fight's like. I'll be honest with you, I've never liked the, uh... Okay, now honestly, the fight with Genshin was pretty bad. Behold! Observe closely this human! Do not be but I have to give it to Vol. He is a proven warrior! He was incredibly tough. He has attacks that are hard to dodge. I can't figure out how to dodge them. 
Well, it, they make no sense. You have to be a hardcore gamer if you want to stand a chance against this guy. He's pretty powerful. So what were the hardest bosses you ever faced? Let me know in the comments below. See you later.